Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Good. Hey guys, and welcome back to Visual Access. What's that? I'm being too loud? Oh. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Welcome back to Vision All Access. I am, of course, your host, Hunter, and today we're talking about the craze that is sweeping the nation. Can I really say nation? I mean, we're, we're Canadian. Does nation still apply to us? The craze that's sweeping the nation, and that is truly wireless earbuds. Now, two years ago, Apple dropped a huge bombshell on all of us, and you might have heard about this product. I mean, it doesn't get mentioned hardly at all. AirPods. They've been through three different generations now and they are a sweep hit. And honestly, if you have the iPhone and are looking for a decent way to spend over $200 to over $300, please send a check, uh, contact information down at the bottom. Just kidding. But just like everything that Apple does, it's gonna get ripped off and people are gonna come up with their own examples. Well, if you don't wanna break the bank, I'm here to talk to you today about some really good low-cost alternatives to AirPods. These are the JBuds Air Sport. Now these are not a review sample. I was not paid any kind of money from these guys or any kind of money, no sponsorship here. This is my own product. I actually spent my money on these. And this video is to tell you why. Aren't I awesome? So let's get into this with a quick unboxing. As you can see with the J-Labs, pretty nice packaging. I do know that there's two different forms of this packaging, so your unboxing experience may differ slightly. First and foremost, we have the J-Lab Air Sports themselves in this nice, not gonna lie, fairly beefy case. Open them up and there they are, nicely seated there. Logo's looking at you right in the face. Take them out, you see they're just regular over, or I guess behind the ear earbuds. Now, an important thing to know is this is a master-slave connection. So if you don't know what that is, essentially the right earbud holds the cojones to both of these guys. Anyway, right earbud is the master, left earbud is the slave. As you can see on the front, there are three charging lights that basically give you an indication of how much power is in them. Take a look under this little flap where it says JLab, the name of the company. You'll actually find some other earbud alternatives. Unlike the AirPods, you're not just stuck with one size, but do pay close attention because this model, as well as its other brethren, the Air Executives, actually come with what I think is a really cool feature, memory foam. So the blue tips that you'll find inside are actually mem memory foam, which will contour to the inside of your ear and give you a really nice seal. And if you turn over the JLab uh, Air Sports, on the bottom you see a nifty little thing where you actually don't need a wire to charge these. No, I'm not talking about wireless charging, but I'm talking about an actual cord. So there's a male USB that you just simply plug into any power brick and it will charge these up. So you're never left without a cord. Another thing that I'm a really big fan of is also the quick start guide that's inside the box where you can see the touch controls that you can get on these earbuds. So you can play, pause, higher, lower volume, skip tracks, even summon your digital assistant. And no, it doesn't matter what your digital assistant is. So just two taps. Who is the greatest YouTuber of all time? <laughs> well, I'm sure I'll get up there eventually. So let's get actually to the brass tacks of this whole video and I'm sure what you're waiting for. Are these any good? Now, first I have to mention the price because this is very key. These guys are only $99. So literally double the savings when it comes to the AirPods. No, they don't have a wireless charging case and yes, that is kind of a bummer because you know I'm a big fan of wireless charging. No, there is no fast charge on these, but let's get to the great stuff about this. These things actually sound incredible for their price. I was personally blown away and I've recommended them already to a lot of family and friends if they're in the market for truly wireless earbuds. For those of you guys who don't know, the Powerbeats Pro, also from Apple, same design, a cost over 300 freaking dollars. This is a $100 pair of headphones that through my testing 
actually sound pretty adequate or close to the Power Beats Pro. Something very important when you're looking at a pair of earbuds is the actual magnetic connection. Does Do they stay in the case okay? Yes, they're in there. I'm giving it a pretty decent shake and these things are not coming out. Battery life is a main key feature on any pair of Truly Wireless earbuds. These earbuds actually pack six hours. That's not when they're in the case, that's just when they're in your ears, six hours. But if you find yourself running a little bit low on juice, don't worry, the case itself holds 40 hours. In my testing, I probably get closer to maybe 30, 35 hours. I don't honestly have to recharge this case all that often though. Now, if behind the ears are not exactly your cup of tea, please do remember they have two other versions. They are the JBuds Air, and then there's the JLab JBuds Air Executives. Just call them the executives. But all in all, for that price tag, these are a great AirPod alternative in my opinion. Heck, they even won my oldest daughter over. Trust me, no easy feat. Anyway, that's it for this review on Vision All Access. I hope you guys enjoyed it. But anyway, let me know down in the comments what is your preferred AirPod alternative? Or do you use AirPods? I'm not here to hate, I just like to know. Don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Instagram, as well as Twitter. Try to stay on those as much as I can, and I will catch you guys next time on Vision All Access.